So what's the problem? Is climate change real or just a media beat up? I don't think it's a problem so much, rather a symptom of a larger issue. So if there's a larger issue involved, why aren't we talking about it? You see what you want to see. The Chinese have a great proverb for it. What you see is behind your eyes. So economists get excited by growth curves like this. I'd love to have a bank account like this. But as a doctor, as a biologist, I know what's coming next. I'm very frightened when I see curves like this. Because curves like this don't exist in nature. Nature won't allow it. So when we see curves like this, we know we're in trouble. Big trouble. This is the problem with runaway growth. When you get to this end of the curve, there's nowhere to go. Problems get very, very big, very, very quickly. And the time you have to do something about those problems gets shorter and shorter. So the only way you can deal with these sort of problems is to come up with a solution before it ever becomes a problem. People are always asking me, how do I become part of the solution rather than stay part of the problem? Simple. The choices we make every day have consequences for ourselves and those around us.